Tom. Hello, everybody. Tom Fox here. Welcome back to Fire Emblem Awakening. In the last episode, we saved a town in ruins from vegetable stealing zombies. Gonna let that one sink in there a little bit. In this episode, we are going to uh, participate in the Infinite Regalia. So, brace yourselves because this is a tough one. The Infinite Regalia. Really? Where are we now? These ruins look like they've been ruined for ages. Visitors from another world! Do you seek our treasures? Is that why you have come? Who are you? We are the Dead Lords. We are the bodies of fallen warriors given purpose. We are made to guard the treasures within these ruins. What? Fallen warriors, huh? You seem healthy enough to me. Powerful even. In our final hour, the hour that changed our world. We fought and paid the ultimate price. No, these forms are the only testament to our sacrifice. <laughs> Sad tale indeed. Do you have names? I am Moose. I am Bovis. I am Tigris. I am Lupus. Lupus. I am Draco. I am... <clears throat> okay, okay, I got the idea. You all have names. That's just grand. We, the 36, stand guard to great treasures. Three paths lead to your reward. Left, right, and center. If power, wisdom, and luck are your allies, summon them now! Well, so there's quite a few of them. Ranging from a couple of Lipuses, Angia, a Bovis, a Simia, another Simia, another Angia, a Bo another Bovis, a Porcus. I believe Porcus uses a sword, yeah, Missile Thane. Hey, it's that sword that, uh, what's his nuts wanted? Um. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, what a missile thing. As You also got... Okay, so Moose is always going to be here. It scrambles up at random for which one they're going to be. All these guys are pretty powerful, too. Uh, Basically, Moose is always going to be the general here. All you got to do is kill him. But there are these three treasure chests up here. And that's our target for tonight, ladies and gents. So we have... One, two, three, four rooms to get through before we can get to those treasures. But at the same time, we also got company in these ruffian thieves here. Well, we're not going to let them get the better of us, are we? No, of course not. We're going to plow right through them, hopefully. So let's go ahead and organize our troops here. Uh, first off, let's have our healers to be as far away from each other as possible. Actually, I got, an, I got a better idea. One here... One here. Uh, Donald's fine there. Actually, is Donald fine there? Yeah, Donald's, Donald's fine there. Uh, let's get... Noe up here. Actually, let me see what I'm up against here. Master Bonite, Sage, Valkyrie. So we got some magic users here, so we're going to need somebody with quite a bit of resistance up there. Whereas on this side, we have uh, mostly physical attackers on this side. You spellcasters, though. Basically, no one can just go in and tank them all by herself. We're probably going to have Gaius with her just to have somebody with them. Uh, meaning... Same, same with uh, you. You could generally get get anybody on her own. As also, so what we're going to also need is probably just have Crumb move this over here, move this over here. Have Gaius and Noe go up that way. Have Anna and then Kiel come up this way. Yarn and Morgan will team up. Donald and you will team up. These two will go to the edges here and heal anybody who needs it and try to stay out of range. And these two will come over here to give aid to these two. Alright, I think I got it. Sounds good. We got this going on, guys. All we need to do by the end of this is be faster than our opponents. Defeat the commander. All right, Gaius Tanoe. Did okay, good. They, they'll have their items. Let's get. Let's see. 
As long as these two aren't here, they'll just go keep going for these two. So I can actually just charge with... Ooh, the only problem is... Oh, I didn't think of that. Hmm, let me see. It might actually be better for me to take them around, because if I have Gaius out... No, we'll, j we'll, we'll wait and see where it goes. That's always ended well for me, right? Ooh, that's good against dragons? Wow! Oh, that ain't good. Actually, it's got less of a chance to hit. If I got the dragon stone plus, I'll have even less of a chance to hit. Gaius helps me, which is a 39% chance of happening. You know what? Let's just go for it and see what happens. Whoa. You know, you don't look very dead if... Uh, look very dead. The other corpses must be jealous. But don't you ever get tired of pretending to be alive? Hey, I know. Why don't we play together? I'll tuck you right out. Maybe I should have just brought a door key with me instead of the, uh, the... There we go! Alright, we got him. He's dead. An odd sound coming out of there. Hey, guys got sword level A. Alright. So let's get these two paired up and go over this way. Hey, guys, it's up. Alright, so we have... A war cleric. Another war cleric. And a Dark Knight. Alright. Should be a problem for Donald and, uh, you. Um... I think it might be better to go on the offensive here, depending on what their range is. Their range is pretty far. Um... Hmm... These two are gonna be off in these two corners here, so it's not actually gonna be an issue at all. I'll put them there now, actually. Get it, you up here, and let's see what my options are here. Bulgadon won't finish him off. Bulgadon will finish this person off, though. What else do I got? I got Mjolnir. Probably better off using Mjolnir, because then I'd be able to actually hit all three of them, no matter what they're doing. I'll be enough. Let's see. Yeah, Mjolnir's probably the best bet. So, let's, uh... He's got his own Mjolnir as well. That's kind of funny. Alright, um, I guess for the time being, I should take out one of the ones that can't do anything to me. Either of the le lepuses are fine. I see. The Dead Lords possess skills as we do. They are dangerous foes. I'll need to exercise caution when directing, to, when directing the others. Not even the finest of treasures is worth getting a comrade killed. I'll help! <laughs> I love... I don't know why. Just like watching him like waddle up there. Look at me! And then just like, boop! So funny to me. I forgot I could do that. I forgot I could do that. <laughs> all right, let's hit him with the Mjolnir again. Here we go. Keep forgetting of all these amazing abilities I have. Also, Ignis and a crit. 177 damage. Not bad. Not bad at all. Ding ding. Tell I've gotten stronger. A lot of my abilities are almost maxed too. Which is pretty, pretty neat. All right, let's get Morgan and Yarn going at it. Up, uh, up here. Could hit him with the bolt axe. Actually, that's the only thing I can't hit them. Whoa, dear. So let's see, two of them are, one, one of them is ranged and two of them are up close and parcel. However, I'm using axes. I do have somebody who uses lances. They're not that strong though. What if I were to switch those two out for her? That might work actually. I get a pretty decent bonus from that. Oh, I can't switch them out because, all right, um. Oh wait, I got I could work around it. Uh switch, transfer. There we go. We'll go ahead here and wait. Actually, you know what? It's probably better. Well, let me just check first. Let me get up here. Uh attack. Oh, I could just go up straight up to him and attack. I don't know why I didn't think of that before. I can't do any real damage to them. Uh let me go ahead and switch and check out what she can do. She'll do more damage. He's also more likely to get hit, especially with that Sulcati there. Uh, it's, I mean, it's 
Well, it's 40 damage at most, but still, that's a lot of damage. I'd rather have Morgan out there, because Morgan can at least take the hits a little bit better. Or not. What the hell? I thought Morgan was tough. Welcome to the Salty Morgan. How tough are you? Um, I think I'm going to have him use Vengeance for these guys. And wait. And then there's the enemy phase. Well, Tight formation. Good teamwork. No wonder your treasure is unclaimed. You dead lords are fine, have a fine tactician among you, but not good enough. My mother is a better tactical... has a better tact... Bleh. My mother is the better tactical mind. I'm sure of it. All right, here comes the Soul Kati. My turn. Ooh, neat. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Oh, they've got a Matsu, right? So they attack from far away. That doesn't hit. We gotta win. Yes! Oh, thank God. The reason I'm like so happy about this is because they're not adjacent to me, so they're not gonna. That person's not gonna do any damage to me from uh, attacking me like that. However, if I happen to come across another fighter, I'm kind of boned. Oh, wow! Alright, well, no, he's got it. No, he's fine. Missile pain. This pork, this guy's got nothing. Alright. Okay. Zappity zap zap with the Mjolnir. Ooh, this is gonna cut it close with, uh, use ability to take hits. Let's see. Let's go. Well, Parthia's not gonna do any damage. <laughs> Poor Gaius. Stuck to being a dragon's, uh, liaison. 12 damage with Nidhogg. Didn't hit, though. So that's good. Here it comes. What do we got here? Three damage with Astra, although... You know what? Half exp I was half expecting Astra to activate. Nicely done. Not gonna lie. Alright, at least I leveled up. Alright, at least I'm getting some of the uh, some of the other stats leveled up here. Any more? Yep. Here it comes. What do you do? Here we go. Guy Bulg. I got Mjolnir, so... I got Ignis. I didn't get a crit. That's Even with Aegis. Oh, man, that's hilarious. Even with Aegis. All right. Well, I've got a huge head start of them, even though it's just the first turn. Ooh. Huh. We doing this? Figured a, like a strategical recourse would have been to stay back. Guess not. All righty. I'm surprised that Dragonstone isn't broken yet. Huh. Who's this guy? Kane is the Valkyrie. I mean, technically you're just giving me more movement speed, so thank you. I think that'd be a good idea. If I come up here, use that, and then come over here and heal up and help uh, help these two to uh, protect them while they open that door. So let's see. One range, two range. Oh, it's not going to matter. Yeah, okay. I, that's a good idea then. Alright. First thing I should do... Can I reach? Yes, I can. Okay. So if I use Mend, that's going to heal her for... Or heal them for quite a bit. So I'm thinking... I'm just a bit wary because I'm afraid that my healer's just going to get absolutely decimated. This guy doesn't move, by the way. He stays put. I think I'll Mend. Go up here and Mend. Alright, neat. I won't be satisfied until I'm the very best. Alright. Let's go ahead and attack you with... I'm guessing Mjolnir, because nothing else seems to do a lot against you. Mjolnir! Alright. Uh... Yeah, Mjolnir. Jeez, if that... If, that, if this person's Mjolnir hit, it's devastating. Although... You know, we could just have Donald come in and take care of them. Ooh, I don't know if that's gonna trigger, uh... That move I have, though, and I might accidentally kill the, uh, the general. Don't be triggered. Okay, good. I was afraid I wasn't gonna trigger that. I can't attack him from anywhere. I could just use my Levin Sword. Oh, I, that wouldn't be enough. Ugh. I wanna get my Levin Sword skill up! I got Critical and I got Donald, so I might as well. 
Ignis! It is true, they are finished. Nicely done. We did all that with just, uh, with just, uh, you. Right up to him. Hi. I'm gonna bite you with my dragon teeth. But we'll do that next time on, uh, on Fire Emblem Awakening. See you all then!